How's it going everyone? This is Alpha Prime back with another Transformers Earth Wars video. And as you can see here, I have a defeat. This is the first defensive loss I've had in months. I can't remember the last time I lost. But each time that I did lose, it was to a Scorched Alliance. So I think it was Scorched Earth the, the first time I lost, or the last time I lost. And now it's Scorched Phoenix. And... Both times that I lost were um, a similar attack style. And uh, the five-star swindle was the culprit that took down my base. So um, five-star swindle for the Decepticons or Sunstreaker for the Autobots. And this is a bot that was in that first batch of five-stars. Let's go watch this. But in the first batch of five-stars that was released. And if you're going to get any bot from that first batch... Definitely, in my opinion, Sunstreaker slash Swindle is the best. The best gunner in the game right now. And uh, he kind of was outdated for a while. But now he's got a special ability 11. And he's got uh, this cool Sunstreaker core or Swindle core. I'll, I'll show you the core later after these attacks. But uh, right now you can see he's just deployed one bot against my whole base. And he's using Swindle's ability here, the flames. And you can see that they, with the, with the uh, with the new Swindle core, they have the little like um, sparks that fly above the flames. So if something blows up, they jump to the next item, which is really really good. It's a huge improvement for him. And another good thing that I want to mention is he's using um, Gator Face for uh, the Septicons, and for the Autobots, um, that's a glitch. And that's the ability to give like smoke screen like uh, distance between his attacks. So you get excellent range now with that with that core or that uh, power power uh, bot. And uh, oh my gosh, he's only got a four star swindle or sorry the gold uh, swindle core. It's not even a G metal one. And look at him, he single handedly took down my base. I've got all G metal cores on my base too, with like healing cores attached to them and healing build bots. And he still was able to take down most of my base with uh, three, four shots like that. And here he goes again. There's the fourth one. And look at that volley there. He just destroys stuff and then hops to something else. And they, oh, look at those explosions. Very, very cool. Very, very underrated uh, bot. See that you can see I, I, I planted the the build the healing build bot there to heal up my multi defense systems, but I didn't. My combiner is not uh, equipped for this battle, unfortunately. It's the first time I don't equip a combiner. That really sucks. But here you go. His bots are in. They, they go through that little uh, choke point that I created. And here you go. You got everything uh, attacking them all at once. Uh, Rhinox pops out. Uh, I should really have that other uh, outpost a little bit lower. But anyway, he's got a combiner too. And uh, high level uh, Trypticon. So my base doesn't stand a chance. He's got uh, full out... Uh, onslaught against my base here with all five star bots and uh, Menasaur here. So you just want to pop down that Menasaur. There, he's got the Nexus core on him too. Um, so you want to pop down uh, Menasaur right when your outpost bot pops out, and you can absorb those special abilities, right? So that's why you why you deploy a combiner at the high levels. And, uh, you know, nothing else is attacking Menasaur, so he's just going to town on my Rhinox here, my five-star maxed-out Rhinox. And he, my five-star Rhinox is going head-to-head to, head to head with him, and he's uh, surviving, which is pretty funny. I actually killed him. <laughs> my Rhinox killed his Menasaur. That's hilarious. But, uh, you know, not enough. I don't have enough uh, defense against him now. He's at the top there. Uh, I have Chromia in my outpost, stunning his bots. And um, another good tip is you put that shell generator at the top there, like I did. And you can see the shell generator is still keeping uh, my HQ alive with nothing else protecting it. So that's uh, my uh, advice to you. But, you know, he, he single-handedly took down my base. His bots are, are, um, are pretty weak. But again, I didn't have an, a, a combiner to protect my base. And my base went down. So... Yeah, like very, very rarely do I lose. Um, hope that uh, you enjoyed that video. And uh, try and get that Swindle or that uh, five-star Sunstreaker. That's pretty cool. But uh, let's go ahead and let's take a look at the cores. I want to show you I want to show you this G1 core that we're talking about here. So 
let's see here. Let's see here. Let's go down to I've got I've got the uh, the Sunstreaker core. I don't have five star Sunstreaker though, so um, I'm not uh, going to deploy that yet or use it yet. But the increased special ability damage by six percent. If you destroy the target, the flames will spread to the next target. So that's just the huge update to uh, Sunstreaker and making him uh, relevant in the game again. We're just going to give you an, a, sh a screenshot of what a maxed G Metal core looks like. 19.3% extra ability damage. That is so key. That is huge. And then if we were to look at um, the Sunstreaker, uh, for the, the, the gold one, like here we go, max this out as well. And you can see that he only goes up to 14 something percent. So that G metal one is, is money. It's, if you could get it, it's like hitting the jackpot there. Huge increase to Sunstreaker. But then, hey, the, he didn't even have a G metal one. He took down my base without it. So if you have it, all the power to you, all the more power to you. If you're not, then you can still get by. And then here's a screenshot of how strong uh, Swindle or Sunstreaker can get. And he deals over 7,000 damage uh, from his special ability. So he's not as strong as, say, Prowl or Brawl, like toe-to-toe, -to -toe, but he encompasses more area, surface area, with the flames. So uh, I think he's the best gunner in the game now. And if you put Glitch on him or Gator Face, like, that, that, like uh, that fellow did, uh, you get so much more range from your, for your bot. And then Swindle and, and uh, Sunstreaker have, have really good range for a gunner. So just really, really good bots overall. If you're going to use gunner style like I do, then you definitely want to go ahead and use uh, Sunstreaker uh, or Swindle. Well, here's my Jazz. Uh, he's got a 7,700. So similar damage to Sunstreaker. That's pretty good. Um, but uh, Sunstreaker is a little bit better because uh, he'll do deal, he'll deal, uh, that more damage to uh, items that you destroy. Uh, he'll, those flames will hop around and attack walls and things like that. So both of them are very, very good and uh, very strong additions to the game uh, with these G1 cores. All right, guys. Well, that's it for this video. It's a short one, but uh, just wanted to uh, give a shout out to you guys. Hope you're all doing well. And uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe and like this video, leave a comment, and uh, I'm going to give out one of my lucky subscribers a free pass uh, to uh, next month's event. So uh, stay tuned for that video, and um, I'll give out some a lucky member. All you have to do is just join my join my. Uh, join my group here or join one of my alliances. And I'll just pop you that uh, core. So uh, that's it for this video, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed it and uh, feel free to share it with your alliance mates and uh, see what uh, you guys can do with wars. Free cyber pass, as you can see. Um, this is this month's Cyber Pass, and it ends in 10 days. So after this one's event's over, the next Cyber Pass that comes out, if you are subscribed to my channel and you've been liking and commenting in my videos recently, uh, I'll, give a, I'll give it a lucky winner every single month, uh, a free Cyber Pass as a thank you for all your support. And uh, please help share these videos so that, uh, you know, just give me encouragement to make more videos for you guys. And, uh, you know, you get the free skin, which is, I mean, I'm not, I don't really care about skins too much. But look at all these prizes. Like, the spark is huge. I like the Titan Smites. Fuel cap increase. This is like money right there. You get extra 25 fuel. Um, and, I mean, that's worth a ton right there just by itself. Troop XP increase. So you get those extra XP boosts. The G metal chips are always nice. Combiner spark. Look at all the goodies. You get so many goodies. You get uh, look at that. If you add the four star and the five star, you get you get uh, twelve hundred fifty four star shards. Uh, G metal core, uh, gold gunner class core chip. So that's huge too. That's a new bonus from this this month's cyber pass. Um, that wasn't been given out before. So. Uh, oh, sorry about that. So I got lots of goodies here. Troop upgrade, G metal XP core, and then here's another 1250. So you get a free four-star bot with the Cyber Pass. 
Uh, it's only nine ninety nine. It's a really good buy. If you're going to spend any money in this game, I definitely recommend you know spending this. You're going to keep uh, Space Ape developing good content for us. If you want the game to be uh, more fun and engaging for us, we got to we have to we have to uh, pay a little bit of money uh, in order for uh, the game to keep running here. So uh, that's one of my one of my top recommendations. If you're going to spend money on the game, buy the buy the Cyber Pass. And it's look at all the the combat chips. Here you get 750 combat chip shards. Sometimes you get those four, the five star shards. So this month there's no five star shards. Uh, they instead they did the combat chips. So that's good. I've actually got enough combat chip shards now to redeem a new combat bot. So I'm going to my next video. I'm going to do a combat video, uh, just highlighting my favorite combat bots. I've got quite a few, and there's definitely some that I'm that I really like, and some I don't like, and ones I want. Uh, in the next batch. All right, guys. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share it. Really appreciate it. Uh, and I'll catch you at the next video. This is Alpha Prime. Peace out.